Hi muckers, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we're gonna continue the conversation around uh, Jojo Siwa. <sighs> well, thank you for watching today. <laughs> um, this Jojo Siwa situation, the more and more I look into it, the more and more I feel disturbed with what she's doing with her platform. Like Jojo Siwa's audience is, it's not like when people say, oh, you're, you're dedicating yourself to a child audience. Jojo Siwa is literally catered for children. Like, this isn't, like, a, an adult that swears who, like, children watch. This is someone who makes content for children. So, when we talk about Jojo Siwa, keep in mind that the content that is being created, the goal is for children to watch it. So, Jojo Siwa, I don't care what age she is, and by the way, she is the same age as me, so I can give her criticism and I'm not talking down to her or whatever. We're the same age. She has a responsibility and her team have a responsibility on who they're exposing to, like, millions of children. So, let's think about the people that we already know that she has been endorsing. Uh, Colleen Ballinger, okay? James Charles, okay? I mean, she did a like, really big collab with James Charles pretty recently. And now, Shane Dawson. Literally... Very recently, Jojo Siwa has done a collab with Shane. And I have not seen it because it's been on Shane's second channel. I want to watch this because people were sending this to me after we talked about Jojo promoting all these, like, YouTubers that have a past with children, right? And Jojo has a responsibility. And if you're not going to protect your audience whenever, especially James Charles has said that he uses his For You page like a dating app, so what? You're bringing more of your children to him who he has in the past messaged children in a sexual way. He has admitted to this. I mean, he deleted the video after, but he admitted to it. Before we get into this, please click the link down below. Sorry, I'm losing my voice because I'm sick right now. I'm vlogging every single day on my second channel. If you want to come down, that would be great. See you over there. Maybe not, depending on what you want to do. Let's get into this video. So again, I do just want to keep in mind that Jojo Siwa, I don't care what age she is, has a responsibility to protect the children that watch her videos. And if you're not going to do that, dramatically change your demographic. Dramatically change your demographic. You want to film videos of Shane Dawson, James Charles, Clean Ballinger, all these people? Great. Go out of your way to change your demographic. Go out of your way to change your demographic. And also, one thing that I want to bring your attention to before I get in this, I wonder if I could pull this up quickly. Reddit Shane Dawson. There's a post I saw here. Shane Dawson Reddit. Let me search the word JoJo. I saw a post on there that I think is interesting. This is a post on the Reddit. About Shane Dawson. The Jojo Siwa obsession concerns me. Now, keep in mind, Shane Dawson had this, like, running bit. And he still does it. Clearly, they're filming videos where he, like, buys posters of Jojo Siwa. And he puts posters of Jojo Siwa, like, up in his living room. And him and Ryland love, you know, Jojo's music. And they buy the Jojo bows. And they, they'll they watch, like, her music videos. And, and they very much so promote, like, this full, like, running bit, running joke about Jojo and stuff, right? It's been, it's been very consistent in Shane's videos for many years. I saw this post. Looking back, I feel so bad that we didn't notice nor comment on how creepy it was that a Shane Dawson, who was 30-year-old, um, was talking about and made many meetings with Jojo Siwa, who was 14, 15, 16 at the time, and whose prime demographic is young children, under 8 years old from what I understand. Well, now Jojo has a responsibility, or her team have a responsibility, knowing that that is the audience. Jojo is no longer the child here. Jojo promotes herself to children, and that is equally as problematic if you're going to abuse it. I know he framed it in an ironic way, like, oh, haha, Jojo Siwa, she's so cool, and Rylan joined in. I remember them both going mad over Jojo Siwa merch in the Toys R Us video. That long-ass video. No, I'm a fan of Jojo Siwa, too. In fact, I discovered her because of Shane. I don't like her music, it is very childish, but I admire her business mentality. How good she is to her audience, always family-friendly and respectful. See? The cracks are forming now. And she's a good influence. The cracks are forming now. And how proud she is to be herself. 
Even when people were making fun of her voice or hair, she played along with it. I think she's a great person. So what do we think? Was Shane fanboying over JoJo part of an enabling mentality or simply an innocent phase? Well, this was posted three years ago, and we now have a collab with them very recently. And it, it bothers me now because it's not like JoJo just defending Colleen. It's not JoJo just filming a one-off collab with James Charles. JoJo is like a serial promoter now of people who have gotten called out in some way for being inappropriate with children, whether it was a year ago or a month ago. It's like she's actively seeking them out, which... Let's get to this. My day with JoJo CY. I had to skip 22 minutes of it because there was no mention of JoJo up until this point. So you're welcome for skipping 22 minutes of your time. <laughs> Oh, okay, it's happening really soon. We're here. Rylan's here. Also, Lizzie, co-host of The Sip, is here, who also is JoJo. Props to them. Props to Ryland and Lizzie for that podcast lasting that long. I remember a little bitter woman named Trisha Paytas and a little bitter man named Ethan Klein who said, that podcast will never last. It's lasted longer than Frenemies. You know what? Biggest fan. Biggest fan. Music is so overwhelming. Oh my gosh. No, she's told everyone in her contact list that she knows. No, 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 she's no. Gonna meet Jojo Jojo today. It's safe to be around me. <laughs> oh, she's trying to be cool because she doesn't no. I just tell, want to tell me the story of why you think maybe she remembers you. Well, I just want to know if she remembers that one time she drove past me in Burbank while I was smoking in the gutter. <laughs> Okay, Chris, are you excited for JoJo's arrival? Is that why you're wearing that shirt? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, JoJo's on her way. She's bringing her Lamborghini. She has a Lamborghini? She has everything I want. I'm gonna kill what her. is the purpose of this meeting? Is it is it just for a collab or are they doing something? Are they going to Chuck E. Cheese to eat some disproportioned pizza or, or what's happening? Thank you, Tay Marie. <laughs> okay, Jared Sandy just got here. The Dobrik pizza is here. If Jared has to poop... Not the Dobrik like pizza. Holy shit, they're collecting them like infinity stones. Bathroom because JoJo's <laughs> <laughs> Just to make sure, just to make sure. I so I have the Dobrik's pizza over here. Oh my god, did you bring a rainbow shirt for JoJo? I did! <laughs> Wait, that's perfect! We're all on theme. Yes. Happy Friday, JoJo. <laughs> what if this was a surprise party for JoJo? Surprise bride party! Surprise? Surprise party! <laughs> okay, so I have this all set up over here. I have all the Dobrik's pizza. I got every kind of flavor. How should we do this? I haven't done like a food video like this. A long time. I'll start with the middle one. The middle one is like the one that he's famous. He said I haven't made a food video like this in a long time. Correct me if I'm wrong, but the last like three videos we've reacted to from Shane, it's been about like food. And that's no problem, but like why are we lying now? So this is the pepperoni with honey or something? What? Ooh. Ooh, look at those grease cups. You think it sounds so appealing? I mean look at they're literally like holding grease. Oh, you've lost me. Who's this? No, that's Grace. That's... <laughs> oh, that's the, uh... What is that? Wait, what is that? <laughs> it's like a pie. Hold on. Oh, it's a vodka sauce pizza. Let's see what this one is. Oh, okay, it's Hawaiian. Okay. Uh, I have never tried it, so I'm not gonna go this hard, but pepperoni, or er, Pineapple on pizza. I've never tried it, so I'm not gonna, like... I'm not gonna diss it that much because I haven't tried it, but I don't like, like, that texture difference. Like, there's a texture difference there. There's a texture difference there. You know, like, pineapple is so, like, there's a, there, there's a texture difference there. I can't do this. So I'm not gonna like diss on it because I haven't tried it and I don't mean to be that person. It's like the typical like meh, 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 meh. But like the texture I can't. I can't even eat pineapple on its own because of the texture. Pineapple is like the one that like is like stringy, right? It's the stringy one, right? It's not hard when it's cooked. Okay, I'm not trying it. Yeah, I will. And I'm not getting hit with honey necessarily. But. <laughs> you might have to put the honey on. Yeah, it's right here. Oh. Uh, Maybe you dip it in honey. I liked it. Yeah, I, it was good. I, I'm going to be honest. A lot of my friends have gone to Dobrik's and they say that it's not. A lot of my friends go to Dobrik's or have gone to Dobrik's and they said that it like wasn't good. 
at all. I wanted to try it so bad when I was in L.A. <laughs> I wanted to try it when I was in L.A., but then I couldn't justify um, the embarrassment of walking into a David Dobrik fast food place. I want this meat lovers. Ooh, the honey's good. Get that meat in your mouth. Wow. Oh my god, the most exciting video in the entire world. I don't like that one. I think I like the honey one. <laughs> oh my god, Chris, you have to try one. Do you want me to dip it in honey for you? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Do you want Shane to dip it? <laughs> Listen, every fucking time that we watch a video of Shane Dawson, he is like on top of Chris. Ryland is probably filming this footage right now. Oh my god. Ryland is filming this footage because Chris films. Ryland is filming while... I would never be so disrespected in my entire life. Ryland, pick yourself up, queen. Your tiara is falling. They do it in every video. They do it in every video. Whoa. Did you hear Rylan? Whoa. How could you not like that much honey in your mouth? You? Wow, it's good. It's good. I think it's good. Zoom in on the honey. Yeah, no pizza for JoJo. Fucking hell. This is way better than Mr. Beast Burgers. Oh! Oh, you better shut the fuck up, Rylan. Did they try Mr. Beast Burger in this? Oh, they did. Okay, what timestamp are we on? 25 minutes. Hold on, you guys. This is very important to me. If you know anything about my lore, it's that I love Mr. Beast Burger so much. Okay, hurry up and eat it. Juicy, juicy pickles. Oh my god. I don't want to... uh, okay, sorry. sorry. I think we should start with the two beef burgers. Yeah, let's go right... Oh, the smell. Wait, really? <laughs> oh my god, it's the pickles and the scuttlebutt. Ah! Once again, not a scuttlebutt hater. Let's start with Mr. Beast. Yeah. Okay, I'm cutting it in half. This bothers me. Ooh, oh, juicy, juicy. So good. Sorry. Wow, a lot of uh, mayo. They're like sloppy and slushy, and it's like. Mm. Mm. Actually, the bun's killing it. Oh, it's a double patty. Wow, why is this actually killing it? Wow, I kind of love it. I wish it was worse because if it's just good, then this review is going to be boring. <laughs> it could have been worse. I mean, it's available everywhere, right? People can get it. I'm just saying, it's he, a pretty good burger. Is he giving you a Lambo, or what's happening? Oh, I wish. I would give that burger a 7 out of 10. I mean, I can't. I would remember, give it. So I, would say seven eight, I think it's so eight. good. I'll give it an eight out of ten. Okay, what's next? It's actually really good. Okay. Yeah, I haven't tried that one. Anyway, back to this. They like Mr. Beast Burger. Love it. I'll say the cheese pizza. This is the closest <laughs> I've had to. Oh, thank you, Wolfie. Pizza. Like <laughs> elementary school, free lunch. I'm very into it. I got a shit before JoJo comes. <laughs> Everybody, she's here! She's here! Do you see her face? I see her car. <laughs> oh my god, she's here! Oh, the fix on the car, oh my god. Do you think Colleen's gonna be in the car with her? Colleen's gonna be in the front seat. And James is gonna be in the back seat. We all run what are we doing? Yeah, we gotta we go! Gotta Come on! This music is so crazy. Who is that? really weird that 20 people are going Your car. <laughs> yeah, she's 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 hurt. What kind of reactions do you get driving that beautiful oh my God, thing? It's brutal. It's wild. It's I would throw crazy. so many fucking. <laughs> Hold on, let me finish my sentence. I would throw so many tomatoes at that car. But Sue had just wrote, "Not the internet friend, run and hug." Now, if you do not know what that means. It is <laughs> so funny. That is actually really funny. That is really funny, actually. Um, there's like this, and I can only emote so far because I'm really sick right now, but that is really funny. There is like this, this, it's like a commonly known thing that like your internet friends, and I've experienced it before. Like when you meet people online and you become internet friends through like fandoms or something like that, um, you know, you get really close and you talk every day and you're you're like you're like that right and 
whenever you like spend like four years talking day in day out or whatever meeting for the first time is so fucking awkward <laughs> it is so awkward i have never i mean suha i don't know if no we did it oh my god we did it no we did do that we did we literally did that i remember it it was in it was in london we did it outside of the theater <laughs> We did it! We literally did it! When me and Suha met for the first- Oh my god! I'm just thinking back on it. And so many people watched it happen. We literally, like, ran towards each other. And Suha was across the road. So we saw each other for like- I'm just get, Sorry, I'm getting so loud in this mic. We saw each other for like- Two minutes before we actually, like, hugged. Because she was across the road, and I remember that she had to wait at the red light. <laughs> she had to wait at the red light, so it was super awkward. And so I was standing there, and I was like, try not to look at her, because it's like, you know, then it's so, so like, and then the red light, and I'm coming out of the door, and she's, she, <laughs> this was like, she ran towards me. <laughs> Like, like, char like, charging at me. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's how she ran towards me. <laughs> and then I, you know, run like this. It's so awkward. And then you hug and it's like... You, you, it's... Oh my god, I completely forgot that we literally did that. So, when Jojo and Shane meet, it literally looks like internet friends meeting for the first time. your car <laughs> yeah, she's, she's... <laughs> oh my god I like your jacket <laughs> no 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 oh god and they immediately complimenting each other as well oh Oh, they are both so uncomfortable right now. Oh, God. Who are you? Wow, your car. <laughs> yeah, she's, she's, she's her. What kind of reactions Hi. do you get driving that beautiful thing? Oh, my God, thing? it's brutal. It's <laughs> wild. It's hilarious. Hi, I'm oh, Jojo. I don't think I've met any of you guys. Hi, I'm Lizzie. 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 Sandy. Sandy. My brother, Jared. Jared. Chris. Chris. I like your shirt. Thank you. Happy Pride. Oh, my God. I feel like I'm home. This is so cute. It's so fun. Yeah, this is, this is my car. Do you want to hear her? <laughs> yes. Wait. Wow. Rav goes, it sure is a car. <laughs> You want to hear her? No, but she just sounds. Oh. Really cool. Yeah. Wait. So are people just? I would throw so many tomatoes. So you can like give them a lot of money. They will swerve into me. They will. I've had to become a really, really defensive driver because of it. Because There's... they know it's you. They know it's me, and like they'll just be like videoing while driving, so they'll be like. Wait. Why would you have that on your car? If I look at a photo of myself for long enough, I want to die. <laughs> I'm being serious. Like, what the fuck? If I put my face all over the car, say I was that narcissistic, after a couple days, I'd be like, oh, I don't like how that picture looks anymore. I don't think it's confidence. I think it's narcissism. This is not confidence. Please, this is narcissism. This is narcissism and never being t told no in your life. I didn't video. I'm a bed. <laughs> but I did panic and call my back. It is such a safe. I don't even fucking. It is such a safety. I don't fucking. What the fuck? A walking billboard, yeah.
Wait. Oh. Like the hood. Yeah, she's she's full out. The car actually is inspired for my new merch. Oh. Okay. So it's all the same graphics. <sighs> I brought the hoodies. You said that one's for her. Uh huh. And then I brought you two. I brought because this is the new one that just came out. Wow. Okay. And I was like, you have to you have to try her. Three X. Oh my God, she knows me so well. Oh my God. <laughs> you told me that size. Get out of here. Get out of here. Well, where's this jumpsuit available? This is my indoor skydiving suit. Oh my suit. God. <laughs> You're wearing a skydiving suit? Indoor skydiving, yeah. That That's the best yeah. part I've ever seen. You were skydiving today. Indoor skydiving. Her life is but so yeah. much better than ours. <laughs> what a hideous shirt. And with so much love. Oh my god. Thank you, Jojo. this one's for you, I believe. Don't worry, Jared. I'll give you one. But I wouldn't have a whole... Wait, so like, what is your life? What's happening? What are you doing? Are you a billionaire yet? <laughs> Weird question. Wait, what is the purpose of this? What is the purpose of Jojo Siwa showing up in a Shane Dawson vlog? What? Everybody's so creative. Yeah, it's like... But, okay, so this is literally going to... Okay, so here... This is furthering my point, right? This is Jojo going out of her way... To piss off her audience. Like, and piss off the people that are saying you shouldn't be promoting these people. This doesn't even have a purpose for this meetup. This is literally just filming together for the sake of filming together. I think JoJo and her team are liking the backlash they're getting and are, like, feeding into it more. This doesn't even have a, like, you can't even argue that, like, oh, they're doing something really exciting. She's drove in, or driven into his fucking car park and they're going to talk for a second and then... Uh, I wish. No, I um, I am doing a lot of things. New music. You would die if you heard new music. I'm already dead. You will die. Resurrect me. Bring me to life. <laughs> What's it about? Are you gonna piss people off, Jojo? Yeah. Wait. New music. New TV show. Snapchat. Social media. TikTok. I'm exhausted. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm still going. I'm still kicking. Yeah. Well. Uh, I thought y'all mo like moved. Oh, that's so awkward. Oh, I wish they like pre plan or pre planned their like questions and answers. Yeah, that's a good question, Mom. I wonder if JoJo does get a slice of pizza. Oh my god, no way. Okay, this is skipping ahead. JoJo shows up, they take a selfie with JoJo, and then JoJo drives off again. JoJo doesn't even get pizza, number one. And number two, this is literally just promoting Shane to her child audience for no reason. This is, like, worse than anything. Moved. We did. We moved to Colorado, and then what? now we live what? here. And now I don't know what we're doing. Okay. Yeah, and that title is well, my day with JoJo. What the fuck? Well, that's, nobody does. Wait, I have a question. Nobody so, does. and I'll probably just cut this out, but I've been calling you a lesbian today, but are you Yeah. Lesbian? You are. Yeah. So, such a lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> the girls are awesome. I think they're a lot, and they're dramatic, and it's very hard. <laughs> I've had some really shitty things happen to me, but I've had some really good times too. Yeah, uh, so I keep up with you as a person, as a friend, because I love you and I'm always proud of you. I don't understand it because I don't go on TikTok, so I don't understand the drama. Yeah. I hold the drama. Neither do I. Well, the drama. What? Is Are you okay? Do I need to kill anyone? Um, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I've been not okay. Right now, I'm great. Right now, I'm so good. I'm actually the best that I've been in a really long time. It's hard because, I mean, you know this, especially online. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, Jojo, don't do it. Is she going to do a, Is she gonna do a, a speech about cancel culture? No! 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 Oh, my God. They're ticking every box here. No! Oh, my God. I know what she's going to say. She's going to say social media, like people blow up any little minor thing. And I'm oh, no, Jojo. Isn't everything. The truth is never fully out there, and a no! Oh, <laughs> Jojo, you're killing me! No. So she's meeting up with Shane Dawson, even though like she's pissing off all the parents for promoting all these, you know, people who've been inappropriate with children. And now she's like, "You understand it more than anyone about cancel culture." No. I've also lost my voice, so I'm gonna lose it right after the stream again. Good job, Autumn. For fuck's sake, Jojo. A lot of the time.
sometimes what's happening is I can't say the truth. Because if I say the story, then I am digging myself into a hole. So then something's getting said about me and I can't, I can't defend myself because it just, you know what I mean? Here's the thing, but on the plus side, all the drama that you're involved in is all like dumb teenage girl stuff. That's the other thing, is all the time I have to remind myself like, yo, you're, at the time, my last relationship I was 19, I'm like, you're 19. You're fine, it's not that big of a deal. But it's hard, because it's so real when you're in it. Like, it's like, it's brutal. And you're also, you know, Jojo fucking team. Wait, so this vlog is Jojo Siwa showing up to Shane Dawson's house to ask for relationship advice? What? <laughs> hmm, seems a little bit familiar. I mean, I... Oh, people talking shit. Yeah, you're Jojo fucking Siwa. If I could have been Jojo Siwa three years ago, girl... You were. <laughs> you are. <laughs> Get out of here. Yeah, like, is she not allowed into the house? I'm confused. <laughs> this is so weird. I am. I identify as Jojo Siwa. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> of course, a pronoun joke from Shane Dawson. My pronouns are. He literally did just make a pronoun joke, though. Of course. I, I am. I identify as Jojo Siwa. Where's Jojo? What? Can you like Jojo for a second? No, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. Liz. We're just still tracing. <laughs> You're secretly a fan too. I may or may not watch. Who is this? Oh, hey. Super Pumpin' Iron. Alright. I'll let you guys live your lives. Thank you. I love you. Guys, I'm being 100% serious. What was the purpose of JoJo showing up here? JoJo was there for what? With editing? Could estimate probably 12 minutes? Yeah, she didn't get invited into the house, didn't get a fucking slice of pizza. Everyone's saying promoting merch, but we didn't really see the merch. And it's not linked. What? For clicks and... What the fuck? Yeah, so this is further the, the, the full point about JoJo and her... What the fuck? Jared's so wife? Okay. Good to see you guys. Can she have a make a wish photo with you? Oh my god, yeah. Oh, Absolutely. Would you have a photo? All right. One, two. Okay. Not a make a wish photo when Jojo Siwa actually does make a wish. Uh, okay. okay. Now it's my turn to ask a question. When you guys did the video, where it was the like, you fucking draw a picture outside with some numbers. Uh, yeah. Jojo, language. Is it, was that real? Yes, 100%. Yes. Oh my God, great, cool. Cause I've always wanted to try it, but my mom's too scared do it. to do shit like that. Do it, It's 100% real. There's a free course online. It takes a couple hours. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds reliable, yes. thank you. Okay, cool. <laughs> That's always my biggest question of life, thank you. Right. Real, that, okay. That, yep, that. Right yeah. I love y'all. Oh my. Forever. I really, I I'll have y'all's back forever, Joe just said. This is so weird. Forever. I have y'all's back for forever. I really, I, I love you guys, but I more importantly respect you guys. Forever. <laughs> what? What? Where is all of this? I, it's like, it's like confusing. Don't cry. Don't cry. Hold it together. Don't cry. <laughs> I love y'all. Love you night. Wow, she's everything. Oh she's my god. So I don't... What just happened? What the fuck? We need to try on the merch. Approved. 10 out of 10. Wow. <laughs> what? Maybe get JoJo's merch here. Maybe you guys are right. A day. I would say that was one of the most. So what? JoJo gets her merch promoted and Shane gets a video title that will get a million views because it's my day with Jojo Siwa and she's in it for like three minutes. Entertaining, exciting, fun days I've had in like years. So thank you so much. Entertaining for and fun. Doing that because was not expecting to show us some of it. Like that. And um, that was really fun. It was also nice just to like reconnect with a YouTuber because you talked to each other for like 10 minutes maximum. God, YouTube is so fake. I 
have kind of lost touch with a lot of people. It's such a weird place to be in to not know like who, I don't want to get too deep with all this, but it was nice to see somebody that I haven't seen in a few years and for it to still be. Exactly. They would have been a child by the way back then, but okay. Exactly what it was before everything happened. We just clicked. Right oh my away. God, not him talking about the cancellation too. Uh, can't be asked. Had a great conversation, had fun. Had a great conversation? Talked a lot off camera, just about life. Talked a lot off camera? Your jump cuts, you never fucking moved. Almost ripped the band-aid of this thing where I've been like too afraid to ask people to come on my podcast or too afraid to like ask somebody to come be in a video or something. Cause I'm like, oh, I don't know if they want to or weird. Like Jojo doing that today and having no hesitation and just being like, oh my God, yeah, I want to come over. Like you can film it, like let's have fun. That really did change my life kind of in a weird way. Cause I don't know, it just made me feel like, well, if Jojo Siwa is cool being in one of my videos and like wants to come hang out, maybe I shouldn't be so afraid to ask people. So yeah, that was fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I'm so confused. Did we watch the same thing? So thank you, Jojo. And official review of the merch. Wait, I'm that changed his Jojo life? Flipping off the camera. <laughs> I'm never taking it off. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, yeah, if you want any more videos like this, let me know. Also, I have no idea what I'm going to do next, but I don't think it's... Hopefully something better <laughs> be able to top this i mean the fucking pimped out lambo how do i top that i don't know all right i'm gonna go what are the comments on this hold on jojo is such a vibe you can tell she's wise beyond her years jojo has such a beautiful vibe jojo is always such a successful teenager to me her relevance The ending with Jojo made me cry. Nye, you better stop. You better stop. Cry out of fear. Ah! Like that? Or, God, I've already lost my voice. I need to stop. Stop. This felt like an old school Shane Dawson video while still being fresh. I really thoroughly enjoyed you taking me back to high school. Oh, he would take you back to high school. Jojo is the friend we all need. Jojo's support and love for Shane has made me an instant fan. Sorry, I normally don't go through the comments this long, but this is actually fascinating. This made my day seeing Jojo come over. No one talking about the encounter, really, at all? What the fuck? Lizzie's make-a-wish photo in front of the car sent me. Jojo seems so genuine in this. Love seeing the more real and less performy side of her. That wasn't the performy side? Fuck. And JoJo's right, Shane. You are more than your cancellation. I am in one of the ethnic grips you were cancelled for making fun of. Distasteful? Yes. But worthy of cancellation? No. I can tell your current genuine... You're currently genuine and have evolved. I wouldn't want to be judged solely on my worst day. So I would never judge someone on theirs. <sighs> okay, I need to end it here because I'm literally just going to keep... But like, I'm going to keep scrolling through. What? I'm like... I was, I was wanting to... Not only was I wanting to be wowed, but... They, my day with Jojo Siwa? She... What? I'm gonna end it here. Bye. <laughs>